Good morning, everybody. This is Captain Dead Pixel here to show you guys how to get everything done for the Sirens Prize adventure, how to get all the tablets, and then also to get the accommodation and the sails. So we're gonna go through step by step. There's also a little cameo made by uh, a certain Sea of Thieves partner that I just happened to bump into while while recording all of this. So cheers to you, mate. Oh, is a YouTuber uh, who's streaming right now. His name's Captain Pixel. Do we know this guy? So, like always, you're gonna go to any outpost and speak to Lorena to begin the adventure. Adventure calls. That's great. He's not much, but here's everything we build rats have learned so far. I hope you find some excitement out there. Then after you speak to Lorena, you're just gonna head uh, whatever direction it is, but you're gonna be heading out to Plunder Valley. It's fortunate you arrived. My associates and I are on a particularly dangerous quest. If you decide you wish to help, come and speak with me once more. Let's get going. Excellent. The value of the treasures I seek cannot be underestimated. They may well be our last hope to save the Sea of Thieves. Three relics of the past. The eyes, the dreams, and the voice of the ancients. Once they were kept safely in sanctuaries filled with hidden knowledge, until they were claimed by the Sirens as part of their sunken kingdom. You must enter these shrines and recover the treasures. The Sirens will jealously guard their prize, but you need not fight alone. When you enter a shrine, seek out the ancient priest. His followers will do all they can to help you recover the relics. We must move quickly, but when you succeed, return to me here. There is much more for you to learn. So we got three of the shrines to go to. We got the Ancient Tears, Ocean's Fortune, and then Tribute. So we'll start here at Ocean's Fortune. First tablet's gonna be right here in the first room off to the right of the main spire. And then there's Fox uh, posing for the video for me. And then I'm not 100% sure if you have to, but speak to the ancient priest. And the second tablet, you have to jump across the bit here after you raise the anchor and then climb up this ladder, and then it'll be right up here on your left. What's nice is they all kind of have this glow on them, so they're a little bit easier to spot. And tablet number three is a bit of a cheeky one. What you need to do after you get across the mast over there, then you climb up by the skeletons, it's right on this coral shelf down here. And this is actually the the tablet that Fox was stuck on, so it was kind of funny to help him with that. Then after that, you keep moving forward. You go into the main room that you have the big fight with the ocean crawlers, and the Dream of Ancients will be there. And then after you finish everything, because all the ancients will spawn and help you fight, the tablet will be right over here, underneath the big like spine. Tablet number five, on the very top level, next to the big like spinning mass puzzle, it's just right off over here next to the siren window. After you've collected all the tablets, head back to the ancient priest and turn in the relic.
Now we're up to the Shrine of Tribute. First tablet is going to be as soon as you pull the lever to open the door, you're going to swim through this tunnel and then directly underneath it. It's right there on the staircase ledge. And tablet number two, what you're going to do is you're going to face to the south, go through this tunnel, get around this corner. And then just over these pile of rocks, just a little bit past it, right on the right. For the remaining tablets, as you can see, you can't really reach this one. You have to do the Siren Statue Puzzle in order to access the rest of them. So once you get that done, the water level is going to raise. So it's right here, right above the uh, archway. That's right in front of the statue with the horn. Then after you finish reading that one, just swim through the doorway. And then over to the left on a little coral shelf is the next one. So after tablet four, you need to go around and step on the pressure plates in order to move the big statue. You're gonna jump in and you're gonna fight some sirens. And after you finish fighting the sirens, you're in the main treasure room. And that tablet will be the back right corner behind the, the table. And right after you're done reading that, you can turn around and you can grab your voice of the ancients. And copy and paste, turn right around, go back to the Ancient Priest, turn it in. And now we're off to the Shrine of the Ancient Tears for our last location. So the first tablet, you need to hop up and parkour around the top bit here. And then right next to the lever to lower the water level in the main chamber area is going to be the first tablet. And just turn around, pull that lever, and then the water's going to start going down. And after you jump in, just turn right around. And it's right here on the rock. Tablet number three, this is where you have to start doing uh, the, the maze puzzle where you have to light all the torches and pull the levers for the door. Next tablet's gonna be right here next to the, the, the turtle painting. And then keep this location in mind as well for later. Then after you finish that area, it's going to be right here at the beginning of the next hallway. Then tablet number five, after you finish going through all the different hallways and light all the torches, the main treasure room will open it'll be right here to the left. And then right next to where you got tablet number three, you gotta open up this doorway, and right here will be the Eyes of the Ancients.
Then after you're done fighting all the ocean crawlers, just turn it right around, bring it to the ancient priest, and turn it in. Now we can finally head back to Plunder Valley. Here at last. There's no time to waste. Incredible. To see the treasures recovered at last. All that remains is to reunite them. And I have been preparing the island for that moment. When you are ready, we will begin the ritual. Be sure that you're prepared. We will certainly attract some unwanted visitors. You're here. Let's get going. Very well. But before we begin, you deserve to learn what is at stake. I have allies in the Sea of the Damned. They have warned me that a time of resurrection is nearing. The Serpent's recent actions all point to one calamitous conclusion. He seeks the rebirth of Captain Flameheart. That must be prevented, for all our sakes. I have agreed to free the soul of their great warrior. A powerful champion, and one of the Ancients' oldest legends. If we succeed, they will fight at our side. To begin with, I must unify the fragments. Hear me, ancient eyes, beholder of distant shores. Hear me, ancient dreams drawn from ceaseless slumber. Hear me, ancient voice, and speak your wisdom once again. Hear my call. Ritual is beginning. Climb to the island peak and hurry. The priest is waiting. So after Belle's super epic ritual she just did for us, we need to fight our way to the very top of the island and then to basically defend this okay, priest captain, while he's doing right. his ritual. You'll fight through a couple waves, then you'll fight a soul flame captain, and then you're done. Okay, we actually have to talk to him. Much has changed. Our great warrior is returned to us at last. His essence carried safely across the veil to our sea of tribute. Perhaps your paths may one day cross. Until then, know this. You have battled our greatest enemies with courage and skill. We see now that this realm... Here you go, happy, that's what I just got. ...has rightly called to you as it did to us. It must be. Upon our own, when the time is right, we will return. All right, guys, and that is the whole adventure done. If you guys found this video very helpful, please do me a huge favor and click the like button. And if you enjoy watching any of this content, please consider subscribing. It helps me out a ton. I do record pretty much all of these episodes live on my Twitch channel, so if you're ever interested, want to hang out with me and interact, feel free to click the link in the description. It'll take you straight to my Twitch channel. All right, guys, so that's going to be it for me. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Be safe, and I will see you next time out on the seas.